Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to part two of Monster Sanctuary. Um, words can't describe how excited I am to be finally playing again. Uh, it's been quite a while. It's been about a week or so. Oh, it's just been crazy busy. That's a <laughs> I have no excuse other than that. It's just been really busy. I've been uploading like crazy. Just haven't had time to sit down for a solid 40 minutes or so and just sort of enjoy. So last time, we picked our little eagle guy. We picked up a berry bandit, aka a slime. And I can't remember what I named the other one. I think I named the other one Masora. Yeah, we, we picked up a Masora, so we're gonna keep uh, trekking through. From this, from this wound rivers flowed at, and mountains grew mighty and cold. Tis the only place for any creature that lives in peace with nature. True. Okay, I want the cat with the sword, though. So I'm still not 100% sure how this battle system works. <laughs> uh, I'm definitely going to have to do some learning at some point, but for now... Apparently multi-hits a stack, but I'm not even 100% sure how the stacks work, so I'm, I'm just going to just do my thing. Go for the explosion. Look at that. Channel. That gives them like higher mana or something. I don't know what that did. Okay. Uh, let's go with heal since you're useless anyway. Uh, I guess I could use buff. Oh, I have a tackle attack in this game. Okay, I want the cat with the sword, but I'm, I'm not... I don't even remember how to catch stuff. I'm going to be straight up. <laughs> okay. Let's go with beating. Okay. How do I catch stuff again? I straight up don't remember how to catch. Uh, whatever. I'm just gonna kill it. I'll look it up later. I think you get it, and you know what? I think you get a chance of like uh, receiving them or, or something like that when you beat them. If I if I remember correctly, I think there's some sort of like chance that goes along with it. I honestly just jumped into the game like I was, I was like oh finally it's time to play. I wasn't even like thinking about anything. Like I, I barely remember what we were doing last time but uh it's fine. It's all good. And you're done. One star, let's go. Oh, surprised. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so you get an egg. That's right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I kind of want to name this one Berry Bandit now. Hmm. This one could be bottled. Oh yeah, someone told me I could just use my keyboard. There you go. Oh no, I can't. What the heck? Okay, guess I can't. Oh, I had to. I, I had to press tab. It's fine. My mic is actually in front of my keyboard when I play, so it gets kind of annoying. I have to like put my arms around it, so I, I'd prefer to just use the uh, to reuse the um, 
input commands. I don't really mind. Oh, cool. That's, that's kind of cute. They got a little farm. Uh, okay. Book titles and books read. The Ancestral Tome of Blob Handling and the Hidden Places of Monster Sanctuary Guide. Are, are you going to tell me? Are you going to tell me where those hidden places are? Or? Oh, there's an old friend of mine. Hey, Buren. Long time no see. I've brought in you a new student. He just hatched his first monster. I thought you might teach him some lessons. So you're the new Spectral Keeper, huh? Folk call me old Buren. I've made my home at the end of the Keeper's Trail so I could teach all of you greenhorns about your new duties as full-fledged monster keepers. But first, let's battle to see if you're worthy of the title. You know what? Maybe I don't want to battle. Always observe your enemies carefully. That... The outcome of the battle is decided before it begins. Since I raise these blobs myself, they are stronger than the ones you've seen so far. As you can see, their level is much higher. You can also see weaknesses and resistances of your enemies. My blobs are weak to wind attacks. Oh, okay, I see, okay. Is that what the arrow up means? Like weak to wind? Yeah, it means weak to wind. Okay. I don't have. Do I have anyone with wind attacks though? Is there a way to check? I don't even know if there's a way to. Whatever. Well, I'm assuming my birds have wind attacks, so. We'll, we'll get Bottle Ducky up in here. Let's buff the team. Look at the top right corner of the screen. That's the combo counter. Oh, okay. Every action you do in combo and combat will increase the combo counter based on how often you hit your enemies or healed or buffed your allies. This will increase the damage of following attacks. The combo counter resets after every turn. So it makes sense you always try to act with your weaker defensor, defensive and assisting monsters first, then use high hit count actions. This will maximize the damage of your offensive monsters that act later. Oh, okay. This is win. Take this. Oh, okay, so now I have a six combo. So, so, so now this guy is going to do the most damage. So I should put my heaviest hitter at the end then. So I'll do that next time. Okay, makes sense. Okay, I, I get it though. So, so my, I should put Roxas as, as the third guy, because I, I don't think there's a speed stat. I think it's just whoever's first in line. Ooh. it on him though oh, whatever eat it there we go now we got this big ass combo why oh, does like no damage to any of these guys oh they resist it okay beating them yeah I, I see where I messed up I shouldn't have put this guy at the front I mean at the end okay Honestly, I, I think th I think the uh, the Metroidvania style, like mixed in with these uh, sort of battle, um, sort of turn-based battle combat, is, is pretty cool. Oh, did my guy die? You know what? I've had enough of your guys' bullshit. Oh, they healed this guy. Okay, I'm just gonna kill him. I wanted to take make use of the higher damage that I was getting on the combo, but get rid of it. Stun shot. Arcane bolt. Okay. This is gonna, he might actually beat me. Oh, 
Oh, lightning bolt's a wind type attack? For real? Okay. to get wrecked boys Ooh. I'm sure I have an item that I could use to heal myself let me uh Ooh, that's not good no I knew he was gonna do that no I guess I just stay poisoned forever like Pokemon I kind of, I was kind of a fan of the, of like the way Temtem does it, where like the poison only lasts a few turns. I feel like one attack just being able to permanently screw you over for the rest of the battle is kind of uh, annoying. But uh, yeah. Yeah, apparently these do the exact same damage. So, eee, he's gonna heal himself. I'm stuck in this like endless loop. I think my next attack should kill, but then I might die too, so. No, it's not even gonna kill. What the heck? Okay, you know, screw it. Yeah, I'm dead. I literally just lost a tutorial fight. Why can't I talk to this guy? I'm trying to talk to you, sir. Okay, it's not letting me talk. Let me go inside and leave. There we go. All right, let's do this again. Oh, this is a glitch? I think I glitched the game. Oh, no. Is something going on over there? Okay. Particu oh, he let me move on to the next round? Okay. Particularly powerful monsters are often often described as champions. Okay, that new dragon that came out is a champion. Uh, they have more health, do more damage, and can act multiple times in a turn. It's your job as a monster keeper to take care of them. It's only fitting that you beat one and become a member in order uh, of monster keepers. Show me what you're made of. Okay. Wait, what's he weak to? He's weak to wind. Resist fire. How many times does this hit? Three times, four times. Let's go with... Seem to do the same amount of damage, but this one hits more. Okay. Might. Boom. How many times is multiple? Cheese. Twice. That's not too bad. Eat it. I like the idea of these boss fights. Uh, it takes advantage of this uh, sort of 3v3 combat. See, I'm, I'm basically I'm basically a pro at this game now. I don't know if you guys have noticed. Yeah, look at that. Oh yeah, you got nothing on me, bro. You got nothing.
Oh, that's kind of cool. So I'm guessing that it's gonna take some hits on it on the shield. Yeah. Okay, that's kind of interesting. That's kind of annoying though. to lose our bird, but it's okay. Ooh, whatever. I just hope he doesn't use shield again. Like again. Alright, bird's dead. <laughs> also, am I not allowed to, uh, use, so I guess I'm not allowed to use my fourth monster. It has to be 3v3. Actually, that makes sense from a balancing perspective, I guess, because it'd make it a lot harder for them to, uh... I mean, it'd make it a lot easier for them to balance certain things, like balance difficulty out. Whereas, um... If I could just use six, they'd have to try to balance for six, uh, potentially six, and it, it, I can understand why they would do that. Like, you know, in Pokemon, you have those you have those gyms that have, like, two Pokemon, but you can use six against them. I mean, they, they, they could just balance that by having bosses not let you switch. But whatever is what it is. It doesn't bug me. Come on, man. Mans are being rude, bro. Did I mess up? Is he gonna finish off Roxas? Don't use Stone Rain on Roxas. No! No! I don't think I can win now. That was stupid of me. Revives target. Okay. Yep, sounds good to me. Get out of here. I'm sorry if I'm a scrub, guys. And I'm also sorry if uh, most of my commentary right now is just me yelling at this thing. <laughs> um, oh, wow, I did terribly. You have defeated your first champion, therefore you're a keeper, aspirant. Nothing more is required of you, however, stay. Wow, and listen, won't you? Because there are things going on in the sanctuary that troubles me. You see, monsters can't become this powerful by normal means, and champions usually don't accept other monsters beside them or a keeper in control of them. Champions are always an anomaly, quite rare in nature. I enhanced this goal on myself to make it stronger, but even I couldn't control it for longer periods of time, so I deactivated it most of the time. Recently, keeper rangers have been finding an unusual amount of champions around the sanctuary. I regularly receive letters from by Veromail, from rangers that are stuck in distant reaches of the sanctuary fighting against enemy champions. If it weren't for my old bones, I'd go out there myself, but I can at least keep the keeper's trail safe. I trapped a champion in the caves in this area. You can take care of it if you feel up to the task. Sounds good to me. But before you go, there's one more lesson I want to teach you. Don't worry, I don't have any other monsters for you to fight. This lesson's about feeding your monster. Feeding? Feeding your mon- oh, okay. We'll boost their stats. Caring, your caring for your monsters this way is vital if you intend to face more champions. But a monster only profits from the last three food items you gave it. Oh. That makes sense. Still, the only way to improve your rank is to beat more champions. And who knows, maybe you'll be the one to reach title of Keeper Master. There's only one in a couple lifetimes. We can take care of that other enemy champion right now, or we can go back to the Keeper Stronghold for first. The choice is yours. Is there anything up here? Nope. Okay. Let's uh, save the game. I don't want to quit, though. I'll just reload. <laughs> I'm sure there was a way to save without doing that, but whatever. Yeah, I had no internet in the last couple of uh, the last, like, yesterday. Also, well, I guess for you guys watching this, it'll be the day before, but it was so annoying. Like, my neighbors are basically digging up their driveway. 
and they decided it'd be a good idea to rip the cord because they they uh, rented out one of those bobcats, and I, I saw the cord like on their driveway just ripped, and I'm like, "You guys ripped the internet cord, didn't you?" And the guy's like, "Oh yeah." Come on, man. I got videos to make and shit. Oh no, I don't want to fight these guys. Get out of here. I got videos to make, man. We. What do you think you're doing? Yeah, making the Monster Tamer News video was, was a pain in the ass because my computer doesn't have Wi-Fi. Like, I built the computer, but I didn't make a Wi-Fi thing for it because, like, I didn't buy the Wi-Fi. What is that? Your first time in Keeper's Trail, is it? This is a teleporter stone. You can use it to travel quickly to other teleporters you find me. I'm just a treasure hunter. I make business in the things I find when I buy something. Ooh, okay, we got a... We got a, what's this? Mana Ranger. So this, this seems like an, yeah, hold that MX. Okay. I will buy the accessories and pass on, wait. I can buy as many as I want. The accessories don't break after you take them off, do they? Oh, no, they don't. Okay, so yeah, you don't need multiple unless you plan on using it on the same guy, I guess. Oh, well. Uh, shell gives you defense. Put the gauntlet on you. Whatever. Okay. You're a pretty bad ch treasure hunter, bro. How do I get these? Okay, we open that area. I want to check out. Uh, it's the only teleporter crystal I have access to. As you guys can see, the NPCs are sort of uh, moving around. This is part of the overhaul that they updated the game to. Hey, uh, that I talked about in my news. Hey, fellow keeper, did you know that you can change which of your monsters is following you around? This allows you to use different monsters' abilities. Oh, okay, okay, I got you. Thanks. Can you do anything, bro? Okay, flying stuff does the same thing. What do you do? What do you even do, bro? Get out of here, Roxas. No, 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 I don't want to use Roxas, though. I mean, not Roxas, Barry. Sorry, Barry Bandit. You don't get any usage. I should probably stop nicknaming them because I'm not going to remember their actual names. But I was talking about my internet. So yeah, the internet got cut. It kind of sucked. Uh, I had to, like, I don't have Wi-Fi on this computer because when I built it, I said, hey, I'm Ethernet connecting it because it's just better to anyway. What am I going to buy the Wi-Fi adapter part for it? So I couldn't mobile hotspot. So what I had to do is I had to edit the video, move it to my phone, phone and then use my phone to move it to my wife's laptop and then I uploaded it via my wife's laptop using data tethering. I have like a, this plan that lets me lets me like tether my phone. Uh, sorry, like it gives me, it, it, like I can tether my phone obviously but I get unlimited data for one hour and I can do that like five times a month or something. Uh, so I used, I used the hour, one of the hours to uh, upload the Monster Tamer news. It was a pain in the ass. And you can't spam them in a row. Like, if you use one, you have to wait 24 hours to use the second one. I wonder if I'll actually get anything decent from this fight. Get out of here. Still only three, eh? Huh. What's up, bro? Certain monsters can destroy hidden walls like the one behind me. If you happen to get a monster with a physical ability... Oh, I 
I do. Ha! How did you know the wall wasn't was a hidden wall though? That's what I want to know. Oh, resets the skill tree of a monster. That's something uh, good to keep in mind, I guess. Bandana. I really appreciate the uh, the style of this game. I'm wondering if they should have like a like a quick sw a quick switch option where you just press one button and it just quickly switches between the monsters and ha instead of having to do this every time. So let's say I press like R2 because R1 and R2 seem to do the same thing. You press R2 and then it just shifts to the next one in line. I think that'd be kind of nice if they had that. That way if you want to quickly switch between monsters you don't have to like... Who's this guy? Oh, you're a monster? You're a monk, though. You're not a... Okay, whatever. You're not a real monster. Oh, you're a... Oh, this is the boss. Okay. I didn't expect him to be right here. I, th I thought I'd have to go through something to get to him. Let's go. I'll probably call the episode, uh... I'll probably call it a day for the episode after this. I didn't even check to see what, uh... Types this guy's weak to. No, he resists wind, so I can't even use wind attacks. Uh, it's kind of stupid of me then. I'll probably end the video after we kill this guy, though. Just because uh, I don't want it to go on for too long. But I'm, I'm starting I'm starting to learn the, uh, the systems a little bit. I'm just looking forward to when I'm actually knowledgeable enough to start making videos about it, like guides and stuff. Because uh, as of right now, I am clearly not. Yeah, later today, um, I'm giving away two copies of Nexamon because it's on sale. Uh, later today, I'll post a video, but actually, I'm not sure if the video will come out before. I'll probably post this this video actually after. So if you guys uh, have signed up for it already, uh, that's good. If not, make sure to go check it out. Oh, this is going to suck. He can heal. Damn. Okay, I should have used, used a slime. I could have at least like poisoned him or something. It's, yeah, it's not even worth doing. Oh, that was an accident. That sucks. I wasn't thinking. Oh my god. Oh, I can't... I can switch them out, okay. For some reason I thought you couldn't. Okay, let's go. Oh, he doesn't even have an attack that could potentially poison. That sucks. Okay, whatever. At least I can heal my, my uh... At least I can heal uh, my guy. This is bad. I'm pretty sure he's healing for more damage. I might have to go out and grind before I uh, fight this guy. He's healing more HP with his with his heals than he is that I'm even hurting him for. for like 200 damage or 200 HP I'm definitely doing more damage to him than he's he's um, than he's healing because I don't think he can he can just spam it but not doing as much as I'd like let's heal this turn.
Yeah, he heals like every other turn pretty much. Might have to use a turn to uh, heal my third guy. Oh my god. This is evil. Okay, let's go, uh... <sighs> let's, bring, let's bring the birdie back. It's not a lot of damage, but... Oh, you know what I could do? I could switch the bird over to, uh... What's his face? The other dude. When it gets low, when it gets to lower health, I'll switch it out. Sort of gang up on this thing. I'm sorry if my commentary is uh, a little bit on the uh, dull side. It's just, <laughs> I'm not going to lie, I'm pretty tired. Uh, and I don't want to have fake energy. Like, one, one of my biggest pet peeves is YouTubers that are like, What's going on, guys? Oh my god, this is so awesome. It, no, no. D -d don't pretend, bro. But, uh... No, this game's pretty cool so far. Uh, I have nothing to complain about. Uh, we'll go with the beating. Explosion. I definitely should. I'm definitely gonna have to grind up a little bit. The slime's actually extremely helpful. I didn't realize how helpful it was until. Uh, until <laughs> until this so forgive me Barry yeah I eat that oh he's coming for the slime bro you can't hurt the slime yeah, the slime's really useful as a support actually As long as he just doesn't heal, I don't think he can heal every turn. I think he has to do it every other turn. I'm not sure if he has enough uh, stamina to. Or it could just be that's what the AI is doing. I'm not 100% sure. Because, like, see, see how I can't use my feather attack every turn if I wanted to? Like, when I get to low mana and then I restore, I have less than 60. Maybe his heal costs more. I, I don't know. It probably does, because this is heal level 2, and the regular heal takes like 40, so. Let's go. Beating. I kind of want to use Might, like just to give the bird some extra damage, but I'm not sure if, it'll, if it's worth it. Oh, it's just a regular heal. I thought it was level 2, so I, yeah, I don't know why he's not using it more. Maybe it's just the AI. Mr. Slimy. Heal yourself. I know you're probably I know I know the enemy is probably gonna heal itself too, so. Oh, I can't use explosion this turn. Huh. That is quite unfortunate. Oh well. I don't think I'll be able to use it next turn either. That, that's not good. I need I need that attack. Kind of my uh, my ace in the hole for fighting this guy. Otherwise, he'll just start healing himself. No, I can't. Shit. Okay, I need to use like a like a stamina potion or something. 
I don't have anything like that. Is there an, is there an option to rest? I don't think there is. It's a regular attack, I guess. explosion okay so yeah i don't think there's a rest option I, I remember someone bringing up that there should be like someone wanted one but i, I suppose you could just attack instead like th they were saying that they wanted a rest option so you could like uh rest and gain more mana but i don't know attacking's fine explosion let's go okay he's almost dead he's gonna heal himself for sure but he's almost dead I'm gonna play it safe. And explosion. If it's a crit, maybe it'll kill. Nope. Okay. Attack. Yeah, I guess I guess they don't he either can't or just doesn't spam the healing attack, which is good. Okay, we're going all in. Oh yeah, slime for the win. Let's go. I probably got like one star two stars <laughs> okay I also haven't leveled up my skill points which I probably should do um, but I was kind of just more on the thing where it's like I didn't even see what I got I did that too quick I kind of just more at the point where I'm like I don't really know what the best skill trees to level up are so I'm kind of iffy on whether or not I should um, but yeah, just gonna have to keep learning as we go. And like, like, what if I find better monsters? And I, well, I guess the skill points they don't, they don't know. It's not like Sekiro. Oh, an ocarina. Like the skill points are for each monster. It's not for your thing. like if you give if you give someone a, a skill key or a skill point, it's not like it's gonna, it's gonna. Um, yeah, I'm not trying to battle anymore. I'm, I'm done. I'm done battling. Just trying to find a good spot to stop. What's this? Can I? No, nothing. Oh! -ho -ho. I don't have any fire types, like anything that's that's gonna be able to open this one though. But yeah, anyways, guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna call it a day from here. Um, I thought I saw some fire monsters over here, so that no, was just cats. Yeah, anyway, I'm gonna call it a day from here. Uh, I don't want this to go longer than it has to. It's already been almost 40 minutes. So yeah, that was Monster Sanctuary Part Two. Pretty fun. Um, once again, I'm sorry if my commentary wasn't very. Uh, entertaining i was just kind of tired not really feeling it today but i hope you guys did enjoy if anything enjoyed the nice gameplay but uh yeah for more monster tamer content including let's plays like this and more scripted video essays and whatnot make sure to subscribe like follow me on twitter join our subscriber discord all that fun stuff anyways until next time guys peace